Fighters. I'm going to break this up into several different um, videos trying to go over uh, in more detail all this stuff. So uh, we're going to start off with the events over here. Uh, inside the events, uh, the main thing that you get when you come to the screen is your task. Um, they tell you how many rewards are available. Um, so if you have something, you'll note if you need to scroll down. Otherwise, you won't need to. Some of these things are good to uh, look at just to see, you know, you're running out of Zenny. You might try to figure out um, which one of these give quite a bit of Zenny and you're close to getting. Or, you know, if you're on a run of orbs, um, I got to upgrade an S-grade hero to level 100 and I would be able to get 35 more orbs. So sometimes if you really need to get that next thing and sometimes it's just stuff you didn't even realize um, like uh, that Goku one right here for SS, all I had to do was draw a card um, with gamuts where you pay 200 gamuts and you get that that card. So um, so that's your task reward. You want to come there uh, often. Usually the events blinks uh, with that exclamation mark. Sometimes I can't even figure out why it's blinking because there's nothing I can do. Um, I would suggest that you invest your funds. Especially this one, I think it costs a thousand. Um, and then for the next seven days, when you log in, uh, you'll get your Zenny back. So you pay a lot up front, but it's definitely worth it because you're going to get more than a thousand. Um, and the credit mall is something that comes back and forth, just depends on the event that we're going through. Uh, the more Zenny you spend, that holiday card includes 10% there at the bottom. Uh, you're going to get that back at the end of the event. So the more you spend, you get 10% back. So it's a really great time to be spending because, you know, a week of collecting and spending um, is going to help you get a little farther in the game. You can spend them at the mall. Um, it's hard to say what the best thing to spend here is because if you don't spend um, it within the time, I mean, you, you have the two days and 12 hours, but then I think for an extra day after that, it lets you a day or two um, come back in even though you're not collecting any more to be able to spend it um, I usually went with the divine water too uh, just a way of leveling up my characters more um, I didn't usually spend it on these uh, characters but uh, sometimes that's you know the uh, you really want to buy this S gear down here this battle gloves and durable armor um, but spending 12 to 15 thousand 20 thousand uh, <clears throat> gamuts on the game uh, can be difficult in that short amount of time so um, you know it's the po the training potions um, I mean you're getting one for 30 the divine water you're getting that 80 uh, the holy water is not that I guess that bad of a deal also but you get more experience with the divine water than you will with the holy water um, and a handful is that it ain't really worth it um, but you can collect some of those character cards so uh, so the next, uh, right now there's an event going on where you, uh, you'll want to get five of these a day at a hundred thousand zenny a piece. And then after that, they change to a hundred, uh, gamuts. And, uh, right now, um, you know, this just shows first, second, and third. Um, and we still have two days going on. So you're going to have probably the top three people in the, on the server spending a lot of that extra, uh, gamuts on, uh. On ranking but some of these items are pretty good so uh, always at least spend that you know that 500,000 sometimes when you spend a hundred gamuts you land on the gold uh, gamuts and you get it back anyways your active rewards uh, if for you active players um, this is great because you can get your uh, since you've been every day the exp card in the middle um, once you spend enough uh, or do enough of these items um, is really good and then the potions is pretty all right too um, to get your potions. So you're gonna do all these things within the 24 hour period. They're all pretty easy except um, fight beers might be difficult just because your login time. And the two, uh, claim your two free beams um, can be difficult because of login times. Just depends on what time they uh, go off and how busy you are at those times. Normally I set an alarms um, if I have my phone on me and I'm, I'm available, I can just go and claim my free beans. 
Um, so yeah, I set I set alarms for my free beans and my um, uh, beers. But come back and claim these because at the end of the 24 pe hour period, if you don't claim them, you don't get to save them and claim them later. So, uh, but this is every 24 hours. Right now, this is a uh, Super Saiyan VIP gifts. Um, basically, you're able to claim your VIP level. Um, and it tells you to top up to get to the next level uh, if you want to claim that item. They're not stupendous or anything, but they're free. And it's just for whatever VIP level you are. Um, and you can once you claim them, you can't claim them the next one even if you do top up. It warns you about that. So uh, if you're going to top up later that day, then you probably want to wait till after you top up to claim it. Uh, otherwise, you just want to make sure you claim those. All right, this is top up to get rewards. Uh, basically, what you're doing here is every time you spend in a day, twenty or um, not twenty four uh, during the event, um, five hundred, you're gonna get be able to claim that first sensu bean and the uh, potion. So, uh, if you spend, you know, top up and you spend five hundred, you get the first item. If you spend two thousand that that week, you get uh, you know, the next item and so forth. So this is suggesting to people to to drop some money in the game and collect these items. Uh, as you can see here, you see that uh, what you can claim at 10,000 and 20,000 is the uh, Kid Goku uh, Super Saiyan. That's kind of the, the main idea of the rewards here. They just got done doing one for Goku uh, Super Saiyan, so um, they kind of, you know, all work together. As you can see here in the mall, Kid Goku SS in that top left corner uh, is up there, so... Um, the other things we can look at is the top-up daily reward. So this one's for the daily top-up. Every time you, uh, within that 24-hour period, you can receive this. Uh, it's pretty nice for at least the, the Ginyus. Um, you know, getting 150 which is $5. Um, if you, you're missing out on the bonus if you do it that way, but basically you can uh, just buy $5 a day during this event if you this is something you want to do is spend some a couple bucks or whatever um sometimes you can do google play i haven't figured out why sometimes they're able to do google play and other times you have to do credit cards I, i'm guessing they're getting kicked off of google play for some reason um and sometimes they create another app and it goes on there so anyways um you can spend that five dollars and get you that ginyu or 600 which is twenty dollars um this does not include bonuses so with a bonus if you got uh, 1,000, um, that doesn't count. It, it's the base uh, amount of damage you get. So, And the level up prizes. Uh, this is just simply you hit that level, you can claim it. Um, so as you hit you know, level 10, 15, 20, there's three places you can claim these prizes. This is one of them uh, on that page. The task are the other ones. Uh, it's down here on Gamut's. Let's log in. Let's see. Reach level 35. I'll get 30 gamuts. So that's one place I'll get 30. And then um, level, that's where I would get 500 for hitting level 35. And funds, this is where you can buy into it. And again, I kind of suggested as I am level 30, I've collected um, nearly, was that like 2,000? Yeah, that's, a, that's 2,000 uh, gamuts I've received. Uh, but I only spent that first thousand on it. So I collected a lot of gamuts, um, bought this, and then I can go back. Even if you've already passed that level, uh, you can go back and collect for all those levels that you get. Plus it continues all the way up to level 45. So um, so that's the events. Um, I'm going to stop the video here because uh, I'm going to break this up to hopefully give each person more information without making videos an hour long. And uh, put a link in there so you can see the next video tip. So thanks for watching, guys. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to see them all. Uh, please ask some questions because I'll try to continue my videos uh, and answer more of your questions as I go along. But for right now, that's all the events.